All right, moment of truth. 17. Right at 17. What we're working on today. Hitting some chest. Chest, so Chewy is, what, eight weeks out? Seven and a half. So he is coming off of the Charlotte Cup, three and a half weeks post-show, staying pretty lean. His about the same weight that he was on stage, but he's eating a lot more and doing significantly less cardio. And he's uh, moving to Huntersville. And we had to get one, one more workout in here before he left. I wonder how that's gonna sound on the mic. With that moving around my collar, scraping. Breathing. Breathing. Feel it pulling from the serratus here into your pec. Here you go. Let the weight fall back into it. Yep. All right, let's just keep it, uh, keep it at two rounds. And let's move to incline dumbbell presses. So every other week I start with either a flat or incline, similar to what I have Presley doing right now in his program. All right, make sure you get this on audio. Every first rep, my elbows crack. Like loud as fuck. Like, <laughs> like listen, okay, this is gonna be cringy. All right, quiet, 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 quiet. Of course it doesn't happen this time though. All right, that just means I'm warmed up right. That's gonna count as your 16 set since you did like 50. <laughs> uh, 16, 14, 11, 9. It's rep range. Try to hit, my goal is to hit 145s at the end. So I gotta pace myself. That's at 153. Pressing as much as me at 153. Shit. All right, I got to strap up. I got to strap up my old ass elbows. Move to Smith Machine. Yeah, just move one of these benches. I would do same incline angle, and I want it touching like high on the collarbone. Same rep range here, 16, 14, 11, nine. Probably for you a little bit more back. Yeah. Yeah, how's that feel on your shoulders? Good. This is a little bit heavier than average Smith machine. Not to say that for the camera.
three weeks ago. And I guarantee you, like after nationals, going into another reverse, you'll probably put on another five pounds. Oh, yes, sir. That's it. That's it for that. We got uh, press, machine press is next. We're mowing through it though, that's three quarters of the workout. Three sets, 14, 12, nine. All right, and a build up set for the last one. So after we finish the last set of nine, wait 15 seconds and hit that same weight again for as many reps, so it's a rest pause. All right, but we'll just use that. I'll do this with your shirt off because I want to make a point with this exercise because you can really see what's working with your chest. I just keep it off for the entire workout because there's no one in here anyway. Nice. So it's a good deep stretch and you feel that compression coming back straight across the chest. So this is a really a true press, pushing your back into the pad. And as you can see, he's getting a good stretch in the, right here, the lower portion of the pack. Yep. All right, save it. Good. How's that feel? Yeah. So notice that when he presses, his chest stays forward. It's activating his pet the entire time. His chest is a primary mover with pushing that weight. It's not doing this. A lot of people that use, especially with the machines, we see a lot of this happening. Protraction of the shoulders, shoulders taken over, turn it into a shoulder and tricep dominant movement. So it should be rolling through the chest. Biceps are like lifting the pecs up as you're pressing together. Next, need triceps. Hopefully, my chest is done, dude. Oh god! Three sets of flies. May do either dumbbell or cable seated. Let's do cable seated. Yeah, let's pull it out a little bit more so we get more of a stretch. Yeah, perfect. 18, 16, 14. Hold every fifth rep together for two seconds. Yeah. Three sets. Let's just do three sets. 15, 12, 10. Body weight. This nice control right here. All right, there you go. Lean forward and don't lock the elbows at the top. Right there. Just push through the chest. I may not be able to do these. I don't know this weight, man. Oh my God. Just, just be sure to grab my feet if you need to. No, no, do not spot. Do not spot me from my ass. <laughs> Still got triceps. Just two things though. Show them your triceps. They look pretty feathered to me. They're detailed. Got the horseshoe. All right, double rope. Pretty sure Dom got these from John Meadows because I've seen him do these on videos. Pretty much set your hips back. And this way you get more natural range of motion with the ropes kicking it back. Exactly. So 
that wraps up our push day. Joey here, as we said before, is eight weeks out from Universe. Really excited for him. He's gonna definitely be bringing his best. We're in a good position right now. And as far as my prep, it's got still up in the air what show we're gonna do, but things are kind of really picking up momentum now. Feeling really good. Weight's going up with my lifts each week and my body fat is going down. So I'm gonna keep that cruising along. Got a lot more content coming with uh, Chewy in the next uh, few weeks leading into Universe. And we'll definitely be getting more workouts coming to you guys. Stick around.